spiders can be found almost everywhere these days, and although many find them scary and disgusting, they are actually very useful animals. After all, they ensure that we do not get pestered by flies and beetles because they simply eat them. But did you also know that spiders were already crawling the earth hundreds of millions of years ago? Today I would like to show you some of these primeval spiders. Let's get started with the number 5, Mongol Arachna. This is the largest primeval spider that has been found so far. It lived during the Jurassic period about 165 million years ago. The fossils were found under volcanic ash. The bodies of these spiders were about 2.5 centimeters in length, and their leg span was about 8.3 centimeters. That's surprisingly small. After all, many different animals from prehistoric times were significantly larger than their current descendants. But don't worry, a giant spider is also part of our list. Even today, you can still find the descendants of the Mongol arachna in modern Mongolia. They are one of the largest web-building spiders in the world. Number 4. Cryptomaris Hindi Using modern technology, scientists at the Imperial College of London were able to reconstruct this 300 million year old spider. They took 3,000 radiographs of each fossil, and then used a special software to create a 3D model from the images. Even before the big dinosaurs populated the world, this spider lived in the tropical rainforests. The Cryptomartis Hindi had four pairs of legs. The two front legs were used to catch and crush prey. They are the ancestors of crab spiders, which show the same behavior today. Number 3. Eophrenus This spider was reconstructed using the same scientific method. It is a Trigonotarbida, an already extinct arachnid species. 300 to 400 million years ago, it was even more rife than today's spiders are now. Fossils of this kind were found in England. As in the case of the Cryptomartis Hindi, the scientists used them to construct a 3D model of the animal. Turns out, the arachnid actually had spines, which makes it less appetizing for amphibians. In addition, its legs were already relatively long, so it was faster than many insects it hunted. Number 2. Geratonphila burmansia The fossil that contained the body of this male was an extremely important find, as it gave the scientists an idea of what these prehistoric spiders looked like. In addition, it shows the hunting behavior of the web-building spider preying on a wasp. The fossil also confirms the assumption that the animals had a certain social behavior. Most large modern spiders live alone and are sometimes even cannibalistic, so they don't shy away from consuming their own species. However, in a 100 million year old fossil of a spider web, an adult male and a young spider were found in the same web. Number 1. Megarachna This animal was once considered to be the biggest spider of all time. The Megarachna could reach a size of over 50 centimeters. Some statements even speak of up to 70 centimeters. Without the legs, the body alone was already 30 centimeters long. But why can't we refer to the Megarachna as the biggest spider of the world with these dimensions anymore? Isn't it even bigger than the giant huntsman spider? That's simply because it is no longer considered to be a spider. Due to some features that simply can't be found in other spider species, the Megarachna is now considered to be a sea scorpion. Originally, its body had been reconstructed incorrectly. Anyway, the animal lived about 200 million years ago, which is crucial for its size, because back then the oxygen content in the air was much higher than today. Since arachnids and insects need a lot of oxygen for their growth, they could grow much bigger during this time. While we are at it, do you want a video about the largest prehistoric bugs and insects? During the Carboniferous period you could find some really incredible animals on Earth, like a 2.5 meter long millipede. Well, I hope you liked this video. See you soon. Bye!